The accelerating climate crisis has a huge impact on the health and well-being of young people. One of the ways this impact is experienced by children around the world is through resource scarcity. For example, take potable water. Did you know that the climate crisis jeopardizes the quality, safety, and quantity of drinking water? While water covers 71% of the Earth's surface, drinking water is actually much more scarce. In fact, about 97% of the water on our planet is undrinkable saline water in our oceans. About 3% of the remaining water is fresh water. But of that, around 2% is stored in remote glaciers and ice sheets, which leaves less than 1% of our planet's water supply to provide for almost 8 billion people's daily needs. This 1% of available potable water comes from lakes, rivers, and groundwater, all important components of the planet's natural water cycle. However, the climate crisis is having a catastrophic effect on our already limited supply of drinking water. Increasing global temperatures, a side effect of the climate crisis, is causing more severe droughts in many regions, ultimately reducing water supply. Increasing temperatures also impact the water cycle by influencing precipitation patterns. This can mean less snowfall, resulting in less available water coming down from mountains via rivers and streams during the driest, hottest months of the summer. It can also result in even more frequent and intense rains. If you live somewhere experiencing historic drought, you might think more frequent intense rain would be a good thing. However, this type of sudden rainfall can frequently lead to massive flooding, damaging property, threatening lives, and as the water makes its way through urban environments, picking up contaminants and depositing them into existing waterways, polluting critical water supplies. These contaminants like motor oil on city streets or fertilizer runoff from agricultural lands can also result in dangerous algal blooms, polluting water bodies, reducing oxygen, killing marine life, and harming human health. Intense rains onto dry parched land result in rapid runoff and little recharge of groundwater reservoirs, meaning the intense rains are less efficient at counteracting drought than more frequent but less intense rainfall, with the drought still continuing despite rainfall. The threat to drinking water is dire, but there is still time to protect this vital resource, and that means taking climate action now.